Boo Daddy. Perfect, perfect. It's up to you. Oh, thank you very, very much. Appreciate it. You know, Larry, <clears throat> we're half crazy all the time. Mm -hmm. And this time I think we've overdid it. But I think your fans coming by are really going to like what we're doing. What are you doing? We're putting up at the store, we're putting up 22 more American flags out by the road. Now, originally it was going to be how many? We was originally going to put 18. Okay. And now it's expanded to 22. They're going to be up this week. So when you come by, we'll have 22, and then we have our big 80-foot American flag. We're going to have 22 25-foot American flags. Wow. And it's going to be really impressive because we know every one of your fans yep. or our customers love the American flag. And so we can't wait till everybody comes up and takes a picture in front of it. I but, you know, it. we have a little special guest here to um, kind of lead in here a little bit, if we could. Sydney, she's with... Hi, I'm with uh, Beyond the Lens, and we are, in, we are a technotainment um, attraction in Branson, Missouri. We are the old Starlight Theater right in the center of the Strip. Called Beyond the Lens? Beyond the Lens, yes. We provide all types of entertainment for all ages, featuring some of Best in Pop Culture, some interactive exhibits, and uh, virtual reality games. And now, what we're really excited about is our newest attraction, the Fly Ride. Tell me about the Fly Ride. All right. Well, the Fly Ride is it's, it's the first of its kind, one of the first of its kind in the United States. Um, whenever our riders come in, they sit down on the ride. The doors fly up. They're surged out. They're over a screen that is, um, it's a curved screen. It's over four stories high. Oh boy. Yeah, their feet are dangling. They are, um, sorry. Their feet are dangling, and they are over top of the screen. So literally, you are transported into an environment surrounding you, and you have wind, you have scent, you have um, water features. It's just all kinds of special effects that truly immerse you into the environment. And it's so cool, and it's over the top. It we is. had experience of riding this thing. It's over, unbelievable. But you know what you also have? They have put over $5 million in construction yes. in this ride. And over $3 million just doing the filming. Just in film. Filming that you're going to see wow. in this thing. Wow. This ride is actually over five years in the making that we've been planning and building. So we are super excited for this to open tomorrow. Do and people ever say bad words? <laughs> well, they can't. If they do, you can't hear it. Oh, okay. Just wondered. Yeah. Did you ever virtually throw up? <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> and if they do, just keep oh, it look virtual. Her there. And then yes. the, se the second oh. one. Yes. So our our ride is um, our year round ride is the fly across the United States. It takes you across twenty different of um, the United States you know, landmarks. Right. But what's really special is during the holidays we are actually going to feature. Um, Polar Express Journey to the North Pole. Oh, so you wow. get to experience this movie in a whole new way. You are nope. actually involved in it. It's like you have the sensation of flight. You are up there. You are, you know, feeling the train, the wind blowing at you. It, it's, it's amazing. And guess right. where it's at, Larry. You know, obviously we're there. Larry's right right entered this week, the right across from right. Clay Cooper Clay Theater. Cooper Theater, the old Starlight, and they have really changed it. It's unbelievable. Yes. The yes. rides are super. You got to try it. I mean, it's It's, it's unlike open. anything in Branson. We got to get Nadine on that. That's all. Oh, <laughs> we got to strap her in hard if we Talk do. Talk about some bad words. Hey, <laughs> if she says them, she, nobody will be able to hear it. There's so much sound, and she might actually love it. I'm looking forward to writing in it. I hope you do. You'll, well, you you'll will be. love it. He will be. Yes, we oh, open yeah. tomorrow, so Gotta come on. It. it won't crash, will it? No, no, no. I mean, there's $8 million dollars worth of yeah. problems. <laughs> it's okay. I was one of the first test dummies. I made it through, so you're going to be good. <laughs> you don't look like Perfect. no test dummy to me. <laughs> well, Paul, That's we better talk about boots here a second. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah boots. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And you can wear them on these new rides. Hey, what do you All think? Right. Ariette's our sponsor this week on, uh, on bootdaddy.com, and uh, we're featuring the, the, uh, one of the new styles of the Bantam weight, which is the lightest weight cowboy boot out there and obviously has their new all-day comfort insoles. Ariad is all about comfort and technological features. And then a new one that kind of crosses into the line between boots and shoes is this little Chelsea square toe called the Midtown Rambler. Has the new uh, pro performance insole in it. Easy to get on. It flexes with the elastic gussets and super comfortable. You can go to bootdaddy.com, find all of our Ariats there. 
we have over a hundred styles of Variats in our wow. store all the time. So if you are coming down 65, going to Branson, you see all the flags, you got to stop, come in, and try on a pair of Variats. No question about it. Very got good. It. And Larry, yep, that's uh, we invite everybody to come visit us and see all those flags, and come in and have and say hi to us, and we'll just love to see you. And then come to the Fly Theater. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> Sydney's good. Oh, Whoa. Yeah. And, and, and Sydney, Sydney, what do you think? PFI, home of Boot Daddy in Springfield, Missouri. Very good. <laughs>